so i just got this um at my front door and you know what's crazy okay i need to adjust this let's see yeah fair enough right as you guys do know i'm all about gears equipment and all that and apologies i don't have a portable knife so we have to do with the kitchen <laughs> knife uh so yeah i don't even know what is happening because it seems like canadians actually trusts a lot they really don't care what happens i mean they just dropped this at the front door and i'm like what if i wasn't available and someone takes it but anyway so yeah i don't know why i don't have patience when it comes to unboxing i mean there is no unboxing that goes with slow-mo once again my apologies guys um i know this is not a good setup i'm supposed to be doing a proper top view down view all those cinematic angles and all that but i mean with time we'll get there so for now pardon me i'm just have to go into do it this way yep let me take this bikini off the okay i don't know if you guys can see this but um I think this might be a light lighting, yeah, it's part of the items that I ordered a couple of weeks ago, not even weeks, probably a week now. I don't even know why I bought this, I bought this on Black Friday. I placed the order because it was very cheap, honestly, <laughs> that is my main reason for buying it. I have a couple of lights right now, I have this one that is viewing me right now and I do have one which I'm going to talk about soon on the channel. And this one just came in, but I really wanted to delay the process. I mean, I have to do this so you guys will know what is actually inside. Where is the big knife? And it's very weird that I'm using this. So it was delivered by Canada Post. All right, so in the box, first thing first, we do get this thing here. I don't even know what it's about. And then we do get a manual. Um, it's more like when I was buying the, this lights here. I don't know if you guys still remember when I was buying this lights. It's kind of similar package. So this is the manual. It's just a, one piece of paper with nothing at the back and some instructions here. So very simple. I mean, it shouldn't be all those type of wood. I wonder what ling I mean language that is. So in here, oh, okay. So this is the remote. Guys, am I overexposed? Because it looks like it. Let me try and drop the exposure a little bit down. Um, I hope I'm doing the right thing. Okay. Okay. I think this this should be this this should be fine. So we got the remote. Oh, this is crazy. Feels like some piece of toy. <laughs> Damn. So first impression, I'm honestly not happy with the remotes. It's just, it's just not really up to what I was expecting. But I mean, for the price, let's just see what the, I mean, the elephant in the room. I mean, the main reason why we ordered this. Oh, okay. Wow. Wow. Okay. This is actually good. Wow. I think I'm getting impressed. So um, this is the Andua. Guys, my apologies. I don't even know how to pronounce this name. It's called the Andua or Andu. Andua. <laughs> I don't. I, I honestly don't know, but. I mean, if you guys can see the name right here, um, A-N-D-O-E-R. Honestly, I'm kind of impressed because it actually feels better than the one I have here. So uh, this particular one, I think I made I did make a video on this channel. You guys can view it. Um, it's one of the Chinese brands just like this. And it's very much lightweight. Honestly, it's very light. So I was thinking, since this is, because I think I picked this up for about $60, Canadian dollars, which is way cheaper. But the downside is the shipping cost. So the shipping cost actually took the whole thing to 100 and something. I'm not sure, I need to double check. 
which became very much expensive. But you know, that's the trick because sometimes they say an item is, a, I mean, one dollar, and then you only go out and see that the shipping cost is about a hundred dollar. They just trying to do their marketing strategy thing. So let's just put everything together. So this was about a hundred and ten Canadian dollars, which honestly, I don't know what to say, whether it is a bad deal or a good deal. But before we jump into conclusion, I will try and power it out. I mean, I'm going to power this up with, um, I'm going to turn this off and power it directly here and see how it performs against this one. Already, I'm quite impressed with the belt quality because this is actually a metal. I don't know if it's hard plastic or what, but it feels solid compared to the one I have here. I have I mean I've used a couple of lights. It actually feels, I think, quite similar or better than the Godox. Um, the SL60 or is it XW60, what what? So yeah, I'm kinda impressed. I'm kinda let's see what, what's here. How do you unlock this? Oh, so you need to press this button here and then release. So yeah, kind of similar to that one. It's got this aluminum metal thing and then the LED in here. I think I should actually get a thumbnail. I don't even know if that would make sense, but yeah, let's something like this, right? So I'll just have to uh, take the photo and use it on YouTube. Without wasting my time, um, honestly, okay, you know what? I'll confirm the actual price. I need to say it out so you guys can also know what to expect. I mean, because I'm just estimating. I'm not really sure. I Don't blame me, guys. I bought a couple of items. I think Black Friday, I bought about six or seven items. So I need to just check through my phone and you know the actual cost. So just give me a moment. I'm going to turn this off and then put this on. But before we do that, this light right here, is it states that it's 150 watts and this is 100 watts but with regards to the calculations that i did this does not seem to be a 150 watt so it's a good um, thing that this actually came in and this is 100 watts so i'm going to blast the full i mean percentage the full color lights or the full volume whatever to 100 to the maximum and then i'll turn it off and place this on so we can see how it stand out with this one. So let me look for the cable. Okay, so this is the cable that it came with. Um, it's actually the USA Canada type, so I won't need any adapter. You always need to specify when you are buying on the platform, Ali Express. Um, you need to state it because if you don't, you might end up getting a plug which is for another country and that might be a problem. So yeah, it goes at the back, most definitely. Okay, so it's in. Let me blast this to the full volume. This is the full brightness of this light. This is the maximum it can actually go. I got no lights in here except for the one at the back. This is the only light in here and it stays that it's a 150 watts. So this one here is 100 watts. I'm not even sure if it's going to give me the right um, brightness because normally what I've noticed with this Chinese lights, they will tell you that, hey, our light is a thousand watts. But honestly, when you are using it, you don't get that. It doesn't seem like it. The main reason why I'm saying this is because a friend of mine actually came with the Godox SW60 or SL60, some SL60W, I guess, the cheaper version, the, I mean the lesser one. I think that's the cheapest Godox in town. It is actually a 60 watt, but that 60 watt was actually brighter than this 150. That is how I knew that these guys are actually ripping us off. So, this is ready. I'm just going to put this off and then put this in, blast the full brightness, and then I guess you guys will be the judge of it. So, yeah, there we go. Maximum. Let's just do it real quick. So now I got the newer lights 
here with a maximum I mean brightness so it's got full 100 brightness on and I'm not sure how it's actually stuck up with the first one so if you're wondering this is the first light and it's the XZSPL2 what it's a long name man so yeah let me know which one you think is actually brighter but I don't think there should be much of a difference I don't know I don't know you guys can actually um, comment down below so this is a hundred watts and this is a 150 watts and overall I don't think I have much complaints about it it's just maybe a little complaint the fan in there is a bit noisier not too much just a little bit noisier compared to this one which I don't think it's going to be a huge difference if you are using this type of microphone or if you are going to use this for maybe a music video I don't think it should be a big problem but if you are going to be in a tight space corner and you are using maybe a boom arm I think you're going to pick a lot of that noise but I don't think I have much complaints about this I also saw a lot of people complain about this particular light I mean the reviews people saying uh, the light smokes like whilst they are using it it smokes which means definitely there is some electronic issues with it I can't tell I don't see any smoke right now I just have to use it for a while and I guess Maybe in future, if I experience any problems, I'm going to definitely make another video about that. But overall, it seems to perform okay for its price. I can't really complain that much. I'm not really bothered, except for the remotes, which is too plasticky. And honestly, there isn't much to talk about. But it is a light. It is a cheaper light, honestly. An LED light with back display cheap remotes let me say that and i mean it it is quite impressive for the amount and the type of before i just hope it does last that is all i'm hoping for another thing that i may pinpoint that i wish it actually had is a built-in battery okay so this might actually have its own downside but the fun part is you can actually use sony mpf battery on this lights all right it uses two of them so you can just stack two lights i mean two batteries in here and you should be able to run it through anywhere outdoor without any electricity or power but with this one it does not have any slot for batteries i mean it's quite understandable it's cheaper and all that so uh, that is what to expect whenever you want to pick that up um, if ever you want to get one this is not sponsored i bought this with my own money so i don't have any affiliate links but if ever the company is watching this and they want to reach out for next products why not this channel has never got any product for sponsorship not at all i don't think we have one nobody has ever brought the brand here so far so if you are watching this uh, godox wherever whichever company i'm ready for you so yeah um if you have any questions based on this light or if you have one and you're experiencing problems let me know so far i don't have any problems at all but before we go let me take my phone and double check the price um the price here it's actually 52 dollars 13 cent that's canadian and then the shipping cost is about 35 uh, uh 35 dollars 13 cents canadian so the total cost actually ran me to 86.76 uh, 86 dollars 76 cents canadian so it's not really bad i mean this type of light less than 100 canadian i think it's a bargain i think it's a bargain i just hope it does not break anytime soon because i mean sometimes it becomes cheaper for a reason maybe because it does not last maybe because uh, it's flickers but so far I don't see any flickering and I don't see any problems but if ever I encounter any issues in the future I'll probably list it in the comment section or make a video about it but thanks for coming do not forget to hit on the subscribe button and I guess I will see you in my next video stay safe peace